there and thanks for joining us. I'm Connie Tran. There may not be a vaccine out yet to prevent COVID-19, but there are various treatments available to help boost people's ability to fight the illness when they're hospitalized. Cammie Johnson and her husband Jerry both contracted the coronavirus in June. Cammie's symptoms were so severe she was admitted to Clovis Community Medical Center. She credits convalescent plasma therapy to helping her get through her 11-day stay as she fought the virus. When the stay-at-home orders went into effect in March to help slow the spread of COVID-19, Cammie Johnson and her family followed it to a T. I think at that time, you don't kind of believe it will happen to you, but um, we were trying to be careful. What she thought was just a cough and runny nose quickly turned into something more serious. Kind of a fever that came and went. It was a low-grade fever. So we called, we both called our doctors and our, and we were thinking sinus infection, bronchitis, that kind of thing. So we got on antibiotics, but then as the week progressed, I got much worse. Eventually, Cammie was having a difficult time breathing and was rushed to Clovis Community. Tightness in the chest, the, um, I, I started, I, I didn't want to eat. I lost some um, sense of taste and smell. Cammie and her husband, Jerry, tested positive for the coronavirus. Jerry had mild symptoms and quarantined at home to recover. Cammie was admitted to the hospital and prepared for a long, hard fight against the vicious effects of the virus. They took all my, uh, so many tests so they would know what, what procedures I needed and they explained that all to me and then they, they, they did it in succession and then pretty soon I was getting all these treatments. It was quick. One of Cammie's treatments included convalescent plasma therapy, blood donated by people who have recovered from COVID-19 that has antibodies to the virus that causes it. The donated blood is processed to remove blood cells, leaving behind liquid plasma and antibodies. Cammie received two treatments of convalescent plasma therapy during her 11-day stay. I had healing feeling. And it was just amazing to me. I, I just felt it through my whole system. And I know it sounds probably kind of out there, but I really did feel it. Cammie was also treated with remdesivir, antibiotics, blood thinners, and steroids. But she believes it was the convalescent plasma therapy that helped save her life. She also credits the medical staff at Clovis Community for their excellent care in helping her fight the coronavirus. The people around me were so supportive, so even in that busyness of that emergency room, they have time for every person. I don't know how they do that, so that too is really heartwarming. I think of them as angels on earth in PPE. <laughs> they, they are just wonderful, wonderful people.